Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm just Kick the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we're doing a collaboration with the one and only amazing cheerleader, Avon. It's all good with Candace. Jessica, oh, I'm so excited to do this collab with her right now. We've been talking about this for a while, ever since we saw a little tip. I'm Candice, and my YouTube is Avon It's All Good with Candice, and uh, it's tips and tricks and wonderful things all about Avon. Thanks so much for coming on today, Candice. So guys, if you're new here, um, you just met Candice, and I'm Jessica Yick, the Dancing Avon Lady, and welcome to yet another video. Today we are doing a collab, which is going to be super fun because Candice and I were part of the same beauty community. Um, she, uh, she, she, if, guys, okay, you just got to make sure you do go check out Candice's channel because Candice is like one of the biggest cheerleaders. She's such a sweetheart. You got to check her out. She's amazeballs. But we saw this hack and we both struggle with doing winged liners. Like you guys see my struggles. And, um, we we saw this hack using a bobby pin <laughs> and we're like Let's to create that perfect wing so candace you're what, what were you telling me about the the nubbies so these little nubbies actually they do end up coming off so oh. um if we use i'm thinking if we use this the way it is okay. we might get little bloops right we might get a little bloop so yeah. if we can just kind of pull those off unless they've made bobby pins different from when i was younger because it's just wax did you get yours off no trying it's not coming off today today no. because i said that we could do it <laughs> but <laughs> we might have to just live with them on yeah it's not coming off no right, these are this is a really good bobby pin so <laughs> that's the shape right that's the little tip not okay. this tip not this one imagine that'd be really interesting <laughs> Well, that'd be fun. So it's this side that we use. Okay. So now okay. which, now we have to figure out which way, this way on your eye. Okay. I, I right? think, yeah, because you would want the longer side on the top, right? I've, I've seen both. That's the thing. I, I'm going to try this way. We both already have our base makeup done for our eyes. Uh, Candice, what are you wearing today? I am wearing Goddess, Ooh. the new FMG look. Oh, it's so beautiful. I haven't tried that one yet. That oh, I so love good. it. I love it. This is one I purchased. And I've got on, um, let me see, I've got on this as the highlight, mm -hmm. like the biggest one. And then a little bit of this and a little bit of this. And this I have just underneath, just a little cool. bit underneath. Yeah. And I have my primer, of course, my VDL primer. Got to have that. Yeah. Oh my, I wasn't a believer of primer until recently when I tried it. It makes such a difference. It really does. It really does. It just, and because I had it on first and it, it made the FMG pop, I went, oh, that's really bright. <laughs> and it lasts all day, right? It does. Okay. I, I had some on my hand. I put some primer on my hand, tried a different FMG um, mat, and I had a bath with it. I got out of the bath. I got into bed and it was still on my hand after an all day wear. That's awesome. Wow. It was amazing. Yeah. Which one it was, was it? Was it the original one or Serenity or uh, the Shimmer one? It was the original. It was the original. Nice. I want to share with you guys what I have on my face right now. So my base shadow is actually this one here, the Glimmer Shadow Liquid Eyeshadow. This one's in Jade. I think it's been discontinued. And so this is my very last little bit of it. It's such a beautiful, just kind of like greeny with a hint of blue. It, it reminds me of a mermaid. So I have that. And then on top of that, just on my outer corners here, what I have is I'm using the FMG gel shadow in Electra Jellyfish. This so is so pretty. Even, isn't it gorgeous? It, it just even the name of it is just so fun that you just you just have to get it. Really, you just have to get it. Uh, and that's it. I haven't done my mascara yet, and I haven't done obviously our liner. I'm thinking that I'm gonna try two different, <laughs> two different things with the liners. I think that on one side I have the uh, the Face Shop Gold Collagen Liquid Liner Pen, so I'm gonna try that one. And then I'm also going to try the Gel Shadow in Tornado, which is oh, I like that one. I tried it. 
Yeah, you like I this? I do. I like it. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. So I think that, that way I can see if it works for both because I know one's going to be really wet. The only concern I have with the gel is that it's going to be a little bit more dry. So it's going to be a little bit harder for it to transfer from the bobby pin to my face. So that's the only thing I'm worried about. All right. You ready to do this? Okay. So All what right. I'm using is the Super Extend liquid pen. Cool. And boy, did I ever have fun trying to find this today because I thought I left it in my stock and I didn't. I had taken it upstairs. Then I got it confused with our other mega effects liquid. And here I had it the whole time. So it's all good. I found it. It's ready to go. I don't know what I'm doing. Do we line first and then do the, do the tip or do we do the tip and then line? Whatever you decide to do, I'll do the opposite <laughs> because then we'll see both of us. Okay. So you're doing two different products i'm going to do one so okay. i'm going to do what i'll do is i'll do i'll do the line okay i'll do my line first okay. and then i'll try the tip and then i'll fill in on okay, one cool. i will try doing the tip first and then line wow. okay <laughs> this is a really nice pen it's awesome is, is it really wet the liquid liner yeah it's not bad like it's where am i here yeah oh, but it's quite wet. wow i made a really wild mark there we like wow okay. yeah, it's not bad and then this one is the gold collagen liner it's oh, really do I like that I love this liner like I love I'm so sad oh. they didn't continue carrying it but I love this liner I was gonna I should have got one so I'm gonna try doing the wing first so here I am okay gonna... do the wing first I'm gonna line my eye see if I can do this with liquid eyeliner I like it which way am I doing oh oh Oh, oh my god. I gotta this do is this way. hard. I said it's color in the tips first. This could be messy. Oh yeah, that's that's the whole fun of this. This is why this is my last meeting of the day. <laughs> okay, well I think I got one line. Oh my. Okay, so I wanna oh, like, where funny. did they put the like hay? I'm gonna poke my eye out. But you know what? I feel like the longer end, I'm gonna change my mind. The longer end will go at the bottom because I feel like if I do the shorter on the bottom, I'm gonna end up just poking my eyeball. So, okay, so the I'm longer end to... at the bottom. Yeah, the longer at the bottom. Hey, Two. It's all good. And both of us need our glasses. All right, here we go. <laughs> I can't see it. Did it dry already? No, it just leaked into my eye. It's absolutely nothing. Oh, let's try it again. Maybe I didn't put enough on. Yeah, okay, I don't I know see how. It. Okay, I can Maybe see it being so applied easy. on. Did you get it a bit? Okay, so this is what mine looks like. Can you see? It seems like it worked, but that's with that other gel thing, right? That's no, with the this collagen is with one? The, yeah, this is with the collagen liquid liner, which is like my wettest one. That's why I thought for sure it would work. What is wrong with, maybe my face is just too dry. No, like, but it could be, it could be the collagen too. That's true, that's true. Okay, so you know what? That didn't quite work, but I'm still going to try filling it in. Well, that's what I'm going to try. What do you think? I think I'm going to fill it in. Fill it in. Okay, I'm going to try filling it in. This is hilarious. Oh, my gosh. All right. But at least it kind of gave me a kind of a Maybe I didn't even put it in the right spot. Oh, that's okay. I don't know. This might be really, really dark. Like, how long is the wing supposed to go out from your eyeball like that's pretty intense that is intense <laughs> i'm very slow when it comes to this well i find the liner works like the the eyeliner works but i don't think i would ever do it that big so maybe it depends on where you put it on your eyeball so my next one i'm going to go closer into my eye than farther out yeah. I, feel like I look like a cartoon <laughs> I did one eye. That oh, see, that looks really good. It was mostly just my own work. <laughs> well, and that's what I struggled with. I think this is really thick. And, and I think it's just yeah. thick what you're normally used to. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And it, so I'm going to try the second one closer, like closer where yeah. I place it over here compared to I went far out. Well, I think the other thing that we're supposed to do is we're supposed to line it with our lower lash line. So when we go. Oh, so it's supposed to touch right there. So you want to go more like this way as opposed to have it out here. Okay. 
Okay, you I'm gonna try have that my second lower lash So no, you're gonna try it with the new gel <laughs> one? With the gel to see if it stays a little bit better. But what I am gonna do, and a little tip for anyone who's using a gel liner that wants a smoother application, what's the tip? What's the tip? You wanna dampen your, your brush a little bit. It just, I just find it gives a little bit better of a glide. So I just use micellar water. I don't know if that's okay. actually the right thing to use, but that's what I've been using. I think and that'd be better, better. yeah. Yeah, it's better than water because at least I know that this can go by my eyes and I won't, you know, cause an infection or anything. The tip is a little bit dampened. I'm going to use this. That one, yeah. And I think I'll be able to get more product on it, to be honest with you. Ooh. This one I think went better. So I'm going to, I did my corner. Ooh, oh, yeah, that looks a lot better. Oh, that looks so yeah. much better. Yeah. So now I'm going to line. I'm going to color this in. I definitely have more product on it this time. Wow. Okay. This one's not as thick. Okay. But it is long. Okay. So that could just be how much, like how high you're putting it up. Or maybe we need smaller bobby pins. That's mm -hmm. pretty, pretty cat's eyes ish. Yeah. See, that one didn't mark as much, did it? Not much. Oh, I can see it. Yeah, I can see it. It's good enough that I have a good outline so that I, I know where to go. So, so what do you think? I'm okay. thinking that kind of works. What do you think? That yeah, works too, actually. At least it gives me the shape. That's exactly what I was thinking. I grabbed our baby white things so I could fix any mistakes. Yeah. Well, I guess if I wanted a huge, huge cat, cat looking, isn't it, aren't these called cat eyes? I think so. Well, just wing liners. Wing. Yeah. But I guess if I wanted it really, really thick, I've got it. I've got that part down. But it's just how you adjust where you put the. Bobby pin, I, I say for a, a hack or whatever they're called, I say it works. Yeah. Oh, that looks perfect. Right? Okay, that looks, I say that I say for a hack, I say it works. Oh yeah, 100%. I think it works too, for sure. Um, yeah, I, I like it better with the gel. I do like it a lot better with the gel than the liquid actually. I tried the gel, not with this, but I just tried to line my eyes with the gel. I found it really nice. Yeah. And you have more control with the brush. Yeah. I find it difficult to do eyeliner with, with uh, liquid, but mm. that's it's, just me. I do like the gel. I feel it's less forgiving. The liquid liners are a little bit less I agree. forgiving because if you have sh slightly shaky hands, it makes a difference. <laughs> I'm just going to do my, uh, have, like my stars hair. and stuff all over your eyeballs and. You're just wanting a line, not a star or anything outrageous. Which one do you use? This is my go-to. Oh, love it. The love at first lashes. That's my favorite one. Right now I'm using the nourishing super extend, sorry, the, the super extend nourishing mascara. I really That's like my second one. favorite. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's really nice. I feel that it, I like this one because it has the coconut oil in it, but I do yeah. like the love of first lash because it has the vitamin e the it has vitamin e i wonder if you can interchange them i think you can you can definitely I, I mix and match my mascaras if i want a particular formula touching my lashes and then i want a waterproof oh. on top so what i've done before in the past is i would take the um like let's say before we had the waterproof love of first lash i would take the love of first lash and then use the wash off waterproof on top of it to make it oh. waterproof but i've never at, like use two nourishing ones at the same time just because whatever one's on the bottom is the one that your lashes are touching so the other one would just be kind of moot okay but yeah I, that I do sense, alternate so. tubes so like three months I'd use love at first lash three months I'd use a different one like I would use the nourishing one so it, it's kind of like like exercise your body gets yeah. used to it yeah it looks good I like the one um your second one more yeah. yeah, I do too. Yeah, I think that I would probably I, still move it in a little bit, but it did a thinner line because I moved, moved it like closer. But yeah, but that it was cool. Was I think really it works. Cool. Yeah, I think it works too. We should definitely take a selfie and then post it and tag each other afterwards. But yeah, I think definitely this is uh, something that definitely worked. So this is the finished. I think so book. too. I think it's a win. I think it's a win. I I think I would use it if I want to get my wings. Yeah, yeah. Like this, the, the second side looks so good. For you? The yeah, the side other side really is good. too thick. It, it is a little bit too, and it also curved up a little bit. Yeah, the other it one just like, kind of went straight the way it was supposed to. Yeah, so definitely win. I would, yes, I would I, definitely do this again. Awesome.
That was really fun. This was amazing. I had so much fun. It was my first collab and uh, enjoy your wonderful day. So thanks so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give us a big fat thumbs up. And if you're new to any of our channels, make sure you do hit that subscribe button as well as the little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. If you want to check out some really great feel-good videos, make sure you do jump over to Candace's channel, Avon. It's all good with Candace. You're just going to enjoy it there because she is awesome and lovely and absolutely wonderful. The other thing is, if you're interested in checking out any of these products, make sure you go to our e-store links. All of the links will be down in the description box, including Candace's e-store link and my Easter link. All of those um, links will be in the description box. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us on either Facebook or Instagram. Handles will be here. And let us know in the comment section if you have another hack that you think that we should try and we'll definitely try to make it happen. Yeah, that'll be so fun. All right, guys. Love you so much. See you guys in the next video. Bye.